everybody so today I wanted to do my June favorites and I know it's really late so I might make this my June July favorites or I'm not sure because I might have the same favorites in a month so if you don't see July favorites that's why so for my June favorites um, as you guys can tell I definitely gratitude gra gratitude I definitely navigate more towards fashion than beauty and I love fashion I love clothes but I like to keep my makeup natural I stick to a lot of the same products so a lot of my favorites this month are actually fashion favorites and trends and so the first one is actually what I'm wearing and I'm absolutely loving 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 the trend where you wear da -da -da, one of these short tops this is from Urban Outfitters and high-waisted shorts I love that you just show this much skin and I love these like bandeau tops I mean they're not bandeaus because the bandeaus are about to here so they're a little bit longer and you pretty much have to wear them with high-waisted shorts or pants because or else you'd be showing a lot of skin and I don't know you don't really want to do that and so I've definitely been loving this trend a lot. I have a few of these. Um, either I already posted a video with these or I will. So I'll link it in the down bar of how to rock high-waisted shorts video. And then so my next favorite is high-waisted shorts. All my high-waisted shorts from Urban Outfitters. Um, I've never really seen ones that I like anywhere else. And my favorite ones from Urban Outfitters because they have a few different kinds. It's this brand and it's High Rise Cheeky. And why I like the High Rise Cheeky is because they're cut off at the bottom and they actually go up a lot like sometimes if you don't get the right size like your butt will hang out luckily I don't have a butt so my butt does not hang out of these pants but I've seen pictures of people who have their butt hanging out so you make sure you get the right size and the reason I like them cheeky is because if they are too long if they're the size of regular shorts regular shorts probably go down to about here then there's so much length that they just look weird in pictures like it almost looks like you're wearing too much material but this evens out the high waisted to the length ratio so they almost look like you're wearing normal shorts and then the other pair I have are these from Urban Outfitters that I really like and then just the ones that I'm wearing right now which are just regular jeans the next trend that I really like is ugh, come closer is really simple little necklaces this one's from Francesca's I'm obsessed with it it's just a little turquoise bead or stone and then I got a few from Francesca's that I really like for layering because I really like layering the thin necklaces so I would wear this one with it this one is also from Francesca's like I said it's just a little thingamabob and then this one so what I would do is I would wear it like this and then have the longer one down there so I love 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 layering just the really tiny thin necklaces I do love chunky big neck bib necklaces but I think you could wear these like layered for a more casual outfit or for a more night out outfit so that goes really good with both so I'm really loving that trend I've been seeing it a lot on Instagram that's how I kind of thought of it I've been layering like my skinnier necklaces and yeah so I really like that one ton of hair products that I've been trying lately because it's summer and I've just been testing out different things with my natural hair and so um two products that I've really been liking um these are available at like Target or Walgreens or whatever they're by Mark Anthony and this one is the Beach Wave Spray and I showed um the Fakai Beach Wave Spray in my natural hair routine video but I switched over to this one because this one feels more it's not as light and dry as the other spray this one kind of gives you more moisture in your hair this one smells nicer and it kind of just makes my hair feel more nourished I just really like the, the way this one feels and this one makes my hair a lot wavier so I've been wearing my hair kind of naturally wavy with some curls in it lately people have been asking me to do tutorial tutorial on it so I'll definitely do a tutorial coming up in one of my next videos and then this thing is just straight up really cool I'm obsessed with having like really light ends um I just got my hair dyed blonder if you can tell so it's like really really light right now but um this is really cool before I got it dyed obviously it's called easy lights by Mark Anthony and what you do is you spray your ends or like spray this whole thing and then you flat iron it and it is instant highlights like that is probably the coolest thing ever so I was doing it with my ends and I would spray my ends and then I would just like straighten 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 and I would have light ends and I was like oh coolest thing ever so I got those at then my next favorite new favorites is this one is the BB mending complex bumble and bumble to be exact for the truly damaged hair supercharged formulas repair chemically damaged hair for strength shine and protection and you are supposed to coat dry or damp hair daily and so I've been using this when I get out of the shower and everything and it's definitely helped get my hair stronger because my hair has been super super dry from sun and chlorine lately 
it is disgusting. My hair literally felt like straw over the weekend. So gross. So I've been using this and it's definitely helped my hair a lot. It feels a lot better. And then I've mentioned this in a few videos and I finally bought the full size because I went through my whole mini bottle and this is the best thing in the world. Me, my cousin, and my brother are obsessed with it. Yes, my brother, because we found out that Harry Styles uses it in his hair. And so I told my brother that. And then slowly but surely, I realized that I was missing my mini one from my bathroom very often. And then I would find it in my brother's bathroom. So he uses obviously like that much because he has like flow, like really long flow. So he uses it sometimes when he needs it, but um, which isn't a big deal. All guys use this kind of stuff. Um, and then me and my cousin both have really curly hair and we put it in our roots and a little bit on our ends and it is the most, like, it just tames your hair so well and it makes me have perfect waves. So I bought the full size of it, definitely worth it. And then I bought a mini size to see if I liked it because I like doing minis first of the BB Straight Blow Dry. And I've used this a few times and I really, really like it. It's hard to tell because it's been so humid in Chicago. It has been literally 105 degrees for like a week. So it's hard to tell what products are working for my hair because no matter what, my hair is going to get disgusting when I go outside. But while I'm inside, this has gotten my hair pin straight. And my hair is very hard to straighten. So I absolutely love this Bumble and Bumble. A few random favorites. Ah, these things are so good. So I've recently discovered that I might be lactose intolerant. I don't know. I love dairy as well. So I've recently got addicted to iced coffee which has a lot of, um, well, the skinny vanilla latte, which I drink. Lattes have a lot of milk in them. So when I drink them in the morning, I can't eat the rest of the day because my stomach is in so much pain. So I was like, oh my God, I need caffeine. I need caffeine. So I drink green tea and stuff. But Starbucks just came out with these like refreshers and they come in the cans. But today I just decided to buy this because mostly because I got like, felt really awkward. The girl was like, are you sure you don't want to buy it? Like you should buy it. And I was just like, oh my God, leave me alone. So I grabbed it and I was like, okay, just to get her to leave me alone. But I really like it because you can make them at home. So I don't have to go to Starbucks every morning. And they come in a few different flavors. They have like natural green tea, natural energy from coffee. Like they're really good for you. And they give me energy in the morning. So that's been a lot better for my stomach since I'm probably lactose intolerant and shouldn't be drinking coffee anymore. Um, my new favorite primer, because I ran out of my MAC Paint Pot, and this is exactly like it, is my BH Cosmetics Primer. It's just exactly like Paint Pot and Painterly by MAC, but way more affordable. And the only thing I hate is how small it is. My MAC Paint Pot is probably like this big. And so I can't really always get my finger in there when I have a long fingernail, so I'll have to use a brush. But this just works just as well as my MAC stuff, so I'm really glad that I started using this because it's way cheaper. And then another favorite of mine is my dry and shape sigma um shaper so i hate when people use my makeup brushes and when my makeup brushes get really dirty i like to clean my makeup brushes probably at least once a month and it's really hard to clean them and then like get them to dry and get them to dry in the right shape so i got this because i heard a lot of good things about it and what you do is you wash your brushes and then you put them in here to dry and shape them and it's just way better and especially because I use Sigma brushes so this definitely helps me out a lot and it's just been way better for my brushes I feel like I'm not losing as many bristles in the top I feel like they're not like fanning out weird and they're just drying perfectly and it makes me want to clean them more often so I will definitely be using this one my final last favorite is Saint Tropez self tan perfect leg spray so I saw this and I was like what is this and basically it is I'll read what it says lightweight 360 aerosol spray gives instant color and an airbrush finish while building a natural long-lasting self-tan for naturally tanned perfect legs so basically the self-tanner or the self not the self-tanner the bronzing mousse that I use kind of gives you instant color but makes you get more tan as the day goes on this however gives you real instant color like brown on your skin you still have to rub it in with the mitt and gets you it just kind of gives you a more airbrushed brown tan so i really like this i'll put the gradual not the gradual the bronzing mousse on and then if i'm going out i'll put this on it'll make me even tanner it'll make me look smooth airbrushed and i just really really like this it says it's just for legs i use it on my stomach too just because my stomach is my most tan part of my body so i really like this the only thing i don't like is it comes in such a small packaging my june favorites i hope you guys enjoy if you have any june favorites Comment them below so I can try new products for next month and have another favorites video. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.